My name is Teresa Brocky. I am a member of the White Clay Nation from Fort Belknap, Montana. Currently an associate professor at Johns Hopkins School of Nursing, and I have a joint appointment with the Bloomberg Center for Indigenous Health. I had just completed my first five years at Johns Hopkins, and I typically do a lot of reflecting during that time and planning for the next five years. Through that process, I, I identified a couple of, of needs. Um, one was for uh, leadership development, and the other was to enhance my policy impact. I didn't know what to expect, but... I was so excited and that excitement never ended. I find them incredibly impressive as it, not only as indiv individuals, but through their work as well. I grew up on the Fort Belknap Reservation. Uh, I'm a member of the White Clay or Aani Nation. Um, and so that uh, not only lived experience, but uh, the experience as a as an indigenous nurse uh, um, and indigenous educator, all of those uh, I think are aspects of of that indigenous lens that I bring not only to the nursing profession but also to the Betty Irene Moore Fellowship. My desire, uh, my career goal, is to have a positive impact on the health and healthcare of indigenous people. I'm looking forward to engaging uh, not only with the profession, so with nursing organizations and being that voice for Indigenous um, health and healthcare, um, whether it's nationally or whether it's globally. Um, and the challenges we face in this country as Indigenous people um, is common in, across the globe. Uh, the health disparities we experience. This uh, engaging with with leaders, nurse leaders, has already opened like opportunities up for me. I have a longstanding partnership with the Fort Peck, Nakoda and Dakota tribes um, in rural Montana. Right after they um, they experienced a suicide cluster. I started working with them. Uh, and so my first study was on understanding the risk and protective factors for youth suicide. But in 2019, um, my own community, uh, the Fort Belknap community, experienced a suicide cluster. You know, tribal leadership declared a state of emergency after three youth um, died by suicide. And at that time, there was one uh, mental health, behavioral health um, provider. And there was a position that was vacant uh, for 20 years. Our team here at Johns Hopkins decided with uh, with Fort Belknap um, that we would uh, adapt this psych mental health certificate program for nurses that work in Native communities. The Betty Irene Moore Fellowship will allow us not only to adapt the program, uh, the psych mental health certificate program, but it will allow us to evaluate as well. I think more nurses should have an opportunity like this. 